I, I have to apologize if I seem a little groggy or a little foggy today. I had kind of a mishap driving home last night. What happened? Well, we had a snowfall here in uh, the tri-state area yesterday. We only got a couple of inches, and it was uh, bitterly cold, so it was very dry. And for some reason, I'm out of that squirt stuff in my uh, car, the windshield wiper squirt stuff. Yeah. And you, you don't really think about that until, of course, uh, there's none in, in the uh, reservoir there. And after one or two passes with the, uh, the dry wipers and the dry snow, it became sort of opaque. <laughs> and, and really, pretty much all I could see was shadow as yeah. I drove. So I said, I, you know, I, uh, this is a hazard. I better correct this. So uh, we, we got some uh, fluid, the windshield wiper fluid, and, and I... Oh, it's just, some just arrived now. And, and I said, you know, we'll, we'll just fill up the tank and then we'll squirt the windshield on the drive home. And they said, okay, and we'll also throw in a gallon of the stuff so you'll never run out. You'll just, I'll have windshield wiper fluid for, you know, my grandchildren will have Lovely, this yeah. stuff right All right, so they tossed this jug in the back of my car and it was full. It was a full gallon. Now we have, I guess, about a third in there. But you know, they didn't think to tighten down the cap. Ah. So this stuff poured all over my back seat, and it won't freeze. So it's not like you could chunk it out and get rid of it. Right. There was about a two-inch puddle of this stuff in the back seat. Now let's see if we can get anything off the label here. Well, here, I think this is a good sign right here, right there, when you're thinking about spending an hour in a closed car. You want, you want this, you want that someplace. Let's see, it says, may be fatal or cause blindness if swallowed. Vapor, harmful! Uh, so, now, I'm, I'm not stupid. I think, gosh, I, uh, I can't be breathing this stuff. So, of course, I drive an hour and a half home last night with the, with the windows down. <laughs> it was 10 degrees here yesterday, ladies and gentlemen. 10 degrees. Thank you very much. Thank you, Bill. Thank you very much. It's fully blended and ready to use. Oh, well, that's good. It'll put you right to sleep. <laughs> Let's see what's in here. Mm -hmm. It's combustible. It's, uh, it's uh, ammonia. Yes. And it's something else. <laughs> but it is toxic, yes. No, I think they've switched to the non-toxic ammonia. <laughs> it's safe now. The kids can drink all they want. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Let's see. What else have we... Now what are you doing? Huh? Well, you just you grabbed it right off. You know there's a show in progress here. Where, where's the ingredients? Ammonia. That's right. Yeah, no. Thank you. Thank you for underlining that ammonia. Thank you very much. <laughs> Kenny Rogers impersonator Mark Hind. Was that who it was, Paul? It was, uh, sounded just like it. Dave, Dave, Dave. What is it? Ah. That's toxic. Ah. Toxic, Dave. Ah. Ah. Well.